RV here in Frederick, Colorado. It's yours truly, Marlon Bledman. Today, behind me, we have a 2015 Ram 3500. This one is the Big Horn Long Box. You will find a few imperfections while we're going through throughout this unit today. But guys, keep in mind, you are looking at a strong truck, great engine. Again, you might find, like I said, a few imperfections there, but it's gonna be sold as is. We just took it out from the uh, dealer, the Dodge dealer. Uh, we did a few services on there, and this truck is ready and set to go. Again, guys, this is a 2015 Ram 3500 long box, big horn. Come, let's take a look at this engine. What you guys are looking at is a 6.7 liter Cummins turbo diesel engine. And it's also partnered with a six speed automatic transmission. Like I said earlier, we did do a major service on this. Brand new batteries on both ends of this truck. Full service. This truck has tons of life left on it. We're looking at the grill, all chromed. We got a Dodge sign. Enough air intake into the engine. We got tow hooks. This truck also comes with uh, engine block heater, fog lights, great headlights. Previous owner did add aftermarket tires and rims. So you guys are looking at Toyo tires, 275, 70R18s. And you got those Moto, a Moto, <laughs> uh, chrome and black rims. Also fender flares on all four corners of this truck. The Cummins Turbo Diesel Engine badge with the Ram 3500 heavy duty badge on the driver door. Like most 3500s and 2500s, you will find tow mirrors on them. And of course, if you're not using the tow mirrors, you could actually manually fold this to allow you to have your regular mirrors. They are powered mirrors. So you do have your power locks, power locks, power mirror, power windows, and of course, power mirrors. This one does come with the folding feature as well. Cloth seats. One I saw you'll see right now is the seat. Of course, those seats could be easily replaced. Checking the interior. It was a one owner vehicle out of Utah. Apart from the little imperfections there and there, this vehicle was well maintained engine wise and of course a few things inside this vehicle. And we'll take a look inside of the vehicle once we get in there. Aftermark, uh, well this is actually Ram running boards. Back seat, it is a crew cab so you have tons of room. Those seats actually fold up. And like all Rams or most Rams, if you wanna make a smooth surface in the back, you have those add-ons here. You could actually fold, have them stand and it goes across the whole back end. You got a Ram WeatherTech mats. And of course, underneath here, you have a nice little storage box here. Where you can put your tools. It has a little bucket in here. You can put some ice and cold bottles of water if you're taking long trips. As we look at the bed, there's a few dings there and there, but again, you do have your DEF and diesel Phillips right here. Aftermarket rims on the back end as well, of course. And this one does come with airbags for the suspension. Now this is a nice feature to have, especially when you carry in heavy loads and you need that extra power on the suspension. You could actually add and release air to those airbags 
with the controls inside of the truck. Rear sensors, this one does come in for bumper pull hitch with a four pin and a seven pin hookup. Rear camera, and we also have a bed camera as well. One thing the previous owner did that is really interesting, um, with RAM, you do have the the capability of switching from the bed camera to the to the backup camera and what he did he added another screen on the rear view mirror that has that camera for your rear camera as well so once you go inside I'll show you guys what that looks like we got a spray bed liner Straight from the factory, it does come hooked up with the fifth wheel and gooseneck hookup. So you could get the um, you could get the fifth wheel that will actually lock into those four holes on either side, or if you want the gooseneck ball right in the center with your chain hookups on either the front or back of those circles. This one does come with a seven-pin hookup here for your trailer. Rear window, it's electric as well. You got your bed light, this will turn on if you need more light when you're working at night. You can turn that on, get a lot of light inside of the, the bed. And of course, a camera underneath here that will show you the view of the bed. Let's take a look over here. You got all your manuals for this unit. And of course, nice storage up here. This is your airbag controls. And this is for the rear suspension. They will show you a PSI level on this gauge. And this is to add or release air to these airbags. So we'll take a look inside, show you some of the features. Like I said, for all those just tuning in, this is a 2015 Ram 3500 Big Horn Long Box. One owner, well maintained in terms of the exterior. A few imperfections, but it is a great running vehicle. And we at Transwest, we try to sell the best, or we do sell the best used vehicles that we get in on trade. So this one came in, even though with the imperfections, we believe this truck has tons of life. And if you guys are interested, like this unit has everything a rancher might need or somebody just starting up with, you know, pulling a trailer and they want something to start up with, this unit would be the perfect unit for you. With 98,803 miles as of today, as a mileage on this unit. Fully serviced, like I said. Interior, we got the full touch screen. You have heated seats, heated steering wheel. All your AC controls here, you could do it via touch screen or you could do it manually down here. When it comes to your stereo, you have AM, FM, and satellite radio. If your media controls, you could control music through your phone via Bluetooth or via USB. And this is the controls we went over. Heated seats, heated mirrors. You could actually see your cargo light, um, camera. And then you got your settings down here, all your apps, climate control. We went over that a little bit a minute ago. You can actually turn your screen off you could do it through the screen or there is a little button down here saying screen off and you, if you press that back it will go it will turn back on and of course your phone this is how you set up your phone to your Bluetooth and of course we'll help you guys out um, if you have problems connecting your phone to your Bluetooth on your vehicle this one does come with uh, you connect um, you could actually set that up get a subscription through uh, you connect it will, it will help you with getting directions to different areas. If you're in an accident, it will send emergency personnel to your location. If you 
want to press the 911 button, all that will help with getting um, tracking where you are and actually sending that information to the police so they could actually, or fire service to come to your location. This one does have 4x4, so you do have your options here for your 4x4 um, going into high or low or into your two-wheel drive. Down here, you got your trailer brake system. This is the plus and minus to adjust your, your trailer brake. Heated seats, heated steering wheel, exhaust brake, tow on haul, traction off, and of course, if you want to turn off your sensors. We do have a 110 plug-in. Down here, USB, and down here, you got a 12 volt. Like I was saying, if we put this vehicle in reverse, you'll see your bed camera show up, and also up here on your rear view mirror, you will see your rear camera on the tailgate. So you actually see both what's going on on both cameras at the same time, which is kind of cool. So if he's pulling a bumper pull, then he could actually see what's going on, or if he just have a bunch of stuff on the bed, you could actually see what's going on both places at the same time. So this is kind of a smart idea. I haven't seen that done in a while. So once I put this vehicle in reverse the last time, I was like, oh, that was kind of creative. You have your garage controls up here, one, two, and three. And then of course your rear window switch. Handrest, or this can convert to a third seat up front. So you have an additional, additional person in here. So you could have six people in this vehicle at one time. Underneath that seat, you got a nice little storage box. If you close that, then fold the seat, then it becomes a cup holder, hand rest. And inside, you got a storage in here. Also coming for SD card, USB, auxiliary, and of course, a 12 volt hookup. Like I said, you guys are looking at a one owner 2015 Ram 3500 long box. This one is the big horn trim. 98,000 miles. Like I said, you might get some imperfections on the outside, but this vehicle is well maintained. We just took it into our local Dodds dealership, did a really good service to it. If you guys want any more information, we could actually uh, present all that Carfax to you and show you exactly what we did. Um, but if you're just starting up a business or you want to just have a vehicle for your ranch or for your, far for your farm um, or you just want to start, you know, with a 4500 for the first time, that might be the best unit for you right now. So if you guys are interested, please give me a call today. Uh, my name is Marlon Bledman at 303-684-3412 or my cell 661-755-4344. Or you guys could email me at marlon.bledman at transfers.com. This truck drives amazing. That's all I could say. Uh, prove me wrong. If you guys want to come in, check it out, drive it, you will, you will not be uh, disappointed. Thank you very much for tuning in, and I'll see you guys back next week. Enjoy your weekend and stay safe.